Darius on Facebook. Come out here fishing the snow. This ain't the biggest snow we had this year, but it's late, you know, because usually around February, it usually moves out of this area. But unfortunately, it has not. And since we ain't made a video in a while, I thought I'd do this challenge. As you can see, I got two clothes, one bag. We'll see what happens. Uh, hopefully, we get big. But if nothing, hopefully, we get y'all some good content. Stay tuned. Generally, you think the bait fish should be blowing that way. Possibly could be, but what I'm doing is, I'm just hitting these little protected areas because I think when it's cold out like this, I know it don't affect the bass physically that much besides slowing down the metabolism. But I think these little edges right here where it drops off would be my best bet because it will be the water. So we're just gonna work that structure right there see if we can get anything. Escalade, guys, that Escalade from Quantum. Hey, they dared me to do it. Hold on, man. I got gloves. I ain't worried about the hooks now. Hold on. There we go. Get a pick of that. That's dope. All right, fish number one. It's in the books. I ain't done this since I was a kid. God, I was fishing anything as a kid. I don't care what was going on. These days, I'm a little more <laughs> reserved. I'm not, I'm not trying to get out there like that. But uh, 
I had to do this challenge. My buddy Dathan, matter of fact, my buddy had challenged me to do it. He made this bait, so it's, <laughs> no wonder, it's only fitting that that bait work, right? It's only fitting that it work. That's crazy, that was shallow water, guys. Threw out in the deep, nothing. Shallow water, boom. Oh, are you kidding me? A good one this time. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, yes. After the snow, look at it go. Yes. What? What? <laughs> Woo! Look at this chunk. Oh, my Lord. Oh. Hold on, baby. I gotta get you loose. Now get him. There we go. That's what we want. There we go. You know how to pose for the camera. Those are the first two off my quantum escalade, guys. Cause I told you guys I'm switching over to all quantum guys. Out here doing this challenge, and uh, I, let's just take a break first of all. Take, talk about this, guys. I was wanting to do a video on this reel. I'll probably do it more in depth. But guys, if you can, as you can see, it's a smooth reel. Matter of fact, it's a 731 gear ratio, and look at the line counter on the side, guys. That's smooth. Like all my quantum reels I've bought so far, all have that same counter. I like it. The drag on it, perfect, and it's smooth when it casts. And as you can see, it can handle some fish. Good night in the shallow. I'm bombing this thing in the middle, and they're right here. I mean, these fish are super close. Bluegill pattern. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> oh, guys, I'm not slow rolling either. I know a lot of people are like, oh, go slow, be patient. No, I don't always do that. Now, at certain times, I will do that because I know this water temp was a little warmer. We did have some decent weather for a while. When I say wow, I mean like it got up to the 40s and 50s here and there and then drop back down but uh that's decent for the winter time here we don't get arctic cold but man when it gets cold sometimes that water takes a while to warm up these fish right now they're staging so they're gonna eat anyway i kind of figured they might but man it's so it's discouraging when you see that snow out there and it's pretty deep out here it's been it's been melting pretty fast though but it was where I live at, it's pretty deep. It's also, it's pretty nice around there. All right. Look, they want it fast. When I slowed it down, no bites. They want this thing fast. They want it moving. Okay, we got two out there. Let's go out here in the middle again. There we go. There's a little shallow, a little shallow hump out there. I usually catch fish off that when it's like warmer. Hopefully, we can get one off here today. And we did. <laughs> oh man, fish not that big, but she's good. Oh yeah, not a monster. But it's a fish. Yes, it's a fish. <laughs> not a monster, but it, she'll work. I'm proud of it proud of this one guys i would weigh weigh him and see what i get what bag i would get out here but hey guys it's too cold for that crap i'm just gonna see if we can get five still fishing that hump again but see it's kind of crazy out here because uh in the summertime you can usually see it out there it's a little darker area out there that gets real grassy and it drops it'll go from like five foot to like three and a half feet out there it's like a little island that's just underwater over there. Them humps usually hold fish on it. I hadn't put a boat out here or nothing like that, but I've seen it in the summer when it gets low. It won't, it won't show all the way, but you can see the top of it. I actually just seen a fish turn up. That's crazy. That water must not be too cold. Oh wait, that's a mud duck. It's chasing fish. I was about to say, I'm like, no, this is backwards. Uh, it's 
crazy. This is I'm just amped right now, guys. I'm amped right now. I mean, this is this is this is stuff you dream of happening. When you come out here in the horrible weather, the sun makes it look a little easier on you. But them hands, you can see they're red. It ain't that? It ain't that sweet out here? I would throw the jerk bait guys, but it's a little slower. And earlier when I was doing it, my hands got real cold. So I thought I'd run the lipless. This is an all or nothing bait for me. <laughs> Cause I mean, I keep my hands going, keep that blood flowing. And that's something I like to do when it's cold out. But usually if it's too bad out, outside, where you can't travel or something like that, I stay home. But we can travel, our roads are real clear. The snow just dropped overnight, so it ain't that bad out to travel. Fishing-wise, there's nobody out here, as you can see. Probably won't be anybody out here for, for a little while until it warms up. I ain't gonna lie to you, we didn't get five, but we did get some fish. That's one thing I can't say. Apparently, the second spot we hit didn't have as much snow as we have in Tulsa, but it did have snow, and it is still cold, guys. We got on them. And uh, did pretty good, man. I mean, got the new reel working, which uh, you guys already know, Quantum, Quantum, the best reels on earth. I gotta say it now, you know, guy, I was a Shimano guy, but uh, I've changed my mind, Quantum. I went back to Quantum. I mean, as a child, loved that, loved that reel, loved everything about the company, and just kind of straight away, but we're back, baby. And uh, before this gets away from me, because I'm probably cold, babbling, babbling on, let's go ahead and, uh, close this thing out guys i mean i appreciate you guys for watching 30k views man that's awesome and uh let's just keep going guys let's keep pushing let's push this channel up there i mean oklahoma's not on the map yet guys at least not as big as it can be let's go ahead and put that thing out there if you guys are from oklahoma let's rep this place man especially from tulsa close to my heart man i appreciate you guys thank you for the support